people. We are in, uh, I, I would not say emergency state, but we could reach there. But we, I believe we could manage it. The current situation of the Hollis Reservoir is a concern for the Water and Sewage Authority, WASA, according to the acting CEO, Calvin Romain. He said the reservoir has a catchment of approximately 1 billion imperial gallons of water. He said it is currently at 43%. Is that um, a normal level at this point in time of the year? No. Uh, what we usually, our long-term average, is estimated at 73, between 73 and 74%. And that should speak to, to, to the situation we are experiencing right now. According to Mr. Romain, the low levels being experienced will now result in some adjustments and curtailments to manage the reservoir levels. We would have since um, published some uh, revised schedules. Mr. Romain said the authority continues to work with its customers to ensure that the resource is managed as efficiently as possible. Redirecting supply in some instances, we have an aggressive uh, truck borne system. Now the truck borne system we have, while customers could call in, we are proactive about it because we know they had hit areas based on the data coming in. He said the issues at the reservoir is a direct effect of climate change. We anticipate going into the dry season that it may be a rough dry season. This is an opportunity for us to learn to conserve. Mr. Romain is sure that the same is not being experienced at the other reservoirs. At all of our reservoirs, we are experiencing above normal um, lake levels. Actually in Tobago um, we are slightly spilling a bit and every other reservoir we are at about 90 percent um, above um, our average. The areas being served by the Hollis Reservoir spans from Valencia in the east to Aruca in the west. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TTT News.